Hi, my name's Fiona, I'm 34, I live in Christchurch in New Zealand and earlier this year I was lucky enough uh, to meet Helena and get on Mission Slim Possible and it's working really well for me. This week uh, at my weigh-in with my personal trainer I hit the 20kg mark so obviously really stoked about that. I've been on diets most of my life and I've tried everything, yes I've lost weight but I always gained it back so it's really looking for something different and when I saw this um, program online I downloaded the ebook and yeah it'll make sense but when I saw the workshop I thought yeah I'll give that a go. This has just brought everything together. I honestly feel that I'm never going to diet again because I have the answers secrets, I've done the activities, eaten the healthy food and have a totally different mindset now that I never need to diet. I have the answers for being slim. But the most important thing for me is that um, I really feel like I've got the control back in my life. Uh, there's a lot of freedom around food. I used to feel quite anxious about eating. Um, you know, when was the next meal going to be? What if it wasn't yummy enough? And, and I went looking for other food um, to compensate and I ended up binging because of course a breakdown and things like that. So diets hadn't worked for me. Uh, I knew that my thinking around food and eating had to change and that is where Helena came in with Mission Slim Possible. I learnt so much new information. I, I, I just don't have enough um, exemplary words to say about this weekend. This has been given by a person who is a, um, who's talking from first-hand experience. She's talking about knowing what it's like to um, uh, have a problem with food. And from that, it's so easy to be able to um, walk with her on this journey of uh, getting to know our own personalities. None of us in the room were the same. We all had different stories. We all came from all different walks of life. And yet we had a common theme of just being unable to hang on to that loss of weight over the time that we've been dieting. I knew what to eat and I knew how much I should be eating, um, but for whatever reason, uh, I'm sure you know, um, I would break down after a while and just end up just destroying it all and, you know, falling off the wagon, if you will. So um, I knew what I had to change was my thinking, that it was all up here, and that's exactly what's happened. Um, Helena will teach you about why diets don't work, how your brain responds to language, the science behind building habits, the important role that our emotions play. And for me, that's been the overall reason that this has been uh, the reason that I've been able to change, is that the science behind it, it just made sense. It's been absolutely fantastic, Richard. Uh, Helena is a really inspirational speaker. She parts with a lot of information. I've learned a lot about myself and about uh, how to deal with the issues. And uh, I would recommend strongly to someone who's got an issue with their body, with their weight, with their fitness, that uh, this is a course that will help them. And if they commit to doing the things that they learn, they'll uh, be very grateful for having done it. Uh, I think you can trust what I'm saying because I'm not one of those people who has always naturally taken to exercise. I don't even like to watch sport so um, this was a big change for me and nothing's really worked in the past and so I'd gotten to that point where I'd kind of given up hope um, and I was a, a secret eater, overeater, you know, or a fat kid. Um, so I've never been the skinny person either. I've always struggled with food, weight up, weight down. You know how it is. Um, so I think if I if, if I can do this, anyone can. I thought I was the unchangeable person. It's been great to learn about how easy it is to change your mind, to think in a in a more positive way and lose weight. And I didn't realise how many different aspects of our lives made such a big impact on losing weight. I see things very differently now. Um, I, I think differently about food and exercise as well. 